Hey everybody, welcome to My Usual Me and welcome back to Occupy Mars the Game where today we're going to go ahead and test out how far you can actually fly with one jetpack. I ditched the two that were in my backpack from the previous video and I went ahead and I made five fresh ones because I didn't know which one of those jetpacks had been used. So I wasn't sure if I had full jetpacks. Since there is no durability on these jetpacks, there is no way. It says, it does say 400 oxygen, 200 methane is what it says in each one of these. So I'm going to see how far we can get with one jetpack. So uh, and the reason I can do that is because I've marked my old base. We had our old base marked. We're at 13,847.5 meters from there to here. And this one's been marked as well. So I'm going to be able to do that. Let's go to V. Let's go ahead and hit the four button, which is which where I had that uh, in my hot bar. And now I'm going to be able to see how far I can get before I crash, we're gonna, and then what we'll do is I'm not gonna, uh, let me save this game right here. And I could have looked at my other jetpack and seen how many, how much, uh, how much methane I've got. And I don't know if I can recharge this or not with a methane um, generator. We're, we do have methane, uh, 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 the possibility of methane being generated at the house, the original one. So anyway, so we're, that's what we're going to do. So you use shift to go up, and then we're going to go forward. I'm going to stay as low as I can. We're at 13,800. Uh, and I'm just going to go until I, until, I, uh, until I run out of methane. And then we're going to go back, obviously, to this last save. And we're going to go ahead and see. Okay, guys, we're coming in on our... Okay, I just heard a beep. I don't know what that means. But we might be almost out of fuel. It looks like on the back of the jetpack, I'm seeing the lights are looking really, really dim. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to see if we can land in. This is our original base. If you see the, the strips on the sides of the, the wings of the, uh, of the jetpack, they're both looking kind of dim. So uh, they're looking kind of low. So I'm thinking that this is our uh, our fuel that I'm seeing. So this is 14,000 kilometers, guys, or 14,000 meters. We landed. Let's go ahead and let's go into our into our inventory and look at this. This says we have oh my god, 24.5 methane and 49.0 oxygen. So and versus. 402 and 200 so guys <laughs> that used uh 175 methane to go 14 kilometers so it looks like this is a, has about a probably about a 15 kilometer range is what i'm seeing here um i wouldn't push it past about 12 or 13 at most we can make it to our base from either of our bases so what I would do is if you're going to make satellite bases you wanted to fly between, I would set them around 10 kilometers a piece apart. So now we're, we're here. Let's go ahead and let's get some materials because I, am, I can go ahead and I, there's no way of destroying this jetpack, I don't think. All you can do is drop it. So I don't know if I'm going to be – let me just go ahead and unequip this right quick. I already unequipped it. All right, you know what? Real quick, I want to see something. Can I, can I go for – all right, so I can't go back into first person, but can I can I go into first person, hit four, 
Oh, it puts you into third person. So you can't fly in first person. There's no way of knowing. Now, okay, now if you look at my backpack right here and you look to the right where the, the wings are and you see there's a light and you look to the left and you see that there's a light. Let's see, I think one of those is methane and, one of, and the other one is oxygen. Um, and I thought it was on my backpack, but it's not. It's on the wings themselves. See those, those strips to the left and to the right? If I switch out this backpack, if I drop this one, if I just flat out drop this one, and then we equip another one. And oh, there it goes. Hello. And then you go in the first person to hit four. Yeah, okay. So those are that is your fuel gauge. That is your fuel gauge right there, guys. So I didn't realize that. Those lights are full. On the other one, they're not. So let's go ahead and let's um let's unequip the this right quick. Let's see, and go V, unequip, or unequip. And then I'm going to see if I can grind this thing down. I don't think I can. Uh, I don't think it's going to let me. And it's got methane in it, so I might, get, I might get blown up. So let me save my game real quick, just to be safe. And somebody had asked me in the, in the comments, and it got answered, which is why I didn't answer, uh, why I have so many saves, because it eats up disk space. I've got a huge amount of memory on my computer, because I'm a gamer. Uh, I'm, I, you know, it's my job. And so, and, but every one of these saves allows me to go back in time if I want, most people, they just go ahead and they just put, they just save their game on top of each other. But if there's any, if there's ever an issue in the game, I can always go back to a previous save and we can start from there and I don't lose that much progress. So that's why I do that. All right. You should see my, my Skyrim game on PS3. So see, I can't do, I can't destroy this at the moment. There's no way to recycle this. So that means that the, the empty the empty packs are going to be a pain in the butt. To, you can't, just can't get rid of them. So let me go ahead and see about, I've got my old, my old base. Where's my, how's my oxygen doing? You know what, we could, we could use a top off. Oh, I got to see, we haven't been around in a, in a little bit of time. How much do I have? I got a thousand and then 2000 oxygen. I haven't been producing methane right here, but um, I've got two wells. So this other well, I could be producing methane if I need to. Yeah, we could be. I could get rid of one of these oxygen tanks and turn it into methane. Cause I, I've unlocked the methane tank, right? I'm pretty sure. Let me go and expand. And water tank, methane tank. I have, and I just don't have the stuff, but I've got the stuff in the, in the house, I think. Pipes, plates, steel plates, uh, and screws. All right. I don't know if I I, I, I I don't know if I've got the stuff in, in the house or not. I think I do. Um, all right. So what we can do is I can make another well, which is what we'll do. Let me go grab a bunch of stuff. I'm going to make another well. I'm going to make a methane tank so I can make a refill station for this thing. If it, if it can be refilled. I don't know if it's going to be able to be refilled. First of all, let me go ahead and let me fill my my. Oh, I have a I have another oxygen tank in here. The hell's that about? Does this create oxygen tanks uh, automatically? Well, I don't know. That's weird. That's really weird. Full oxygen bottle. There we go. Well, that gives me four oxygen bottles. I'm gonna leave that one there. I don't need. I don't need four oxygen bottles. Uh, I'm, I, I need the space in my inventory. So let's go ahead and fill up our water right quick. Kind of good to be back home, you know what I mean? Water refilled. And 64, 70, that's 100, never mind. Turn off the water. Just because you have a lot doesn't mean you can use a lot. All right, let's go in here and let's see in storage where all my things are. Oh, I have more water bottles and oxygen bottles. Oh, no, that's my original inventory, never mind. Uh, okay, I'm going to need a small circuit board. We're going to need a, a few things. More circuit boards. Materials. Here we go. So, engine, pipe, um, let's see, steel plate, aluminum plate, glass plate. That's all I've got on me right now. I don't think I have anything else. Yeah, that's med, med kits and food. We can make more stuff, though. That's not a problem. Actually, let me see right quick. Let me see what I'm going to have to make. 
And tech team blueprints. I, I want another well. Because where this is going to be just... Okay, so I need solar cells, screws, and electronics. All right, I think I have material. Let's see, what do I have in my inventory? I've got some stuff. Okay, so we can go solar cells. Let's go... Uh, we'll make 10 of those. Packs of screws. We'll make 50 packs of screws. Well, I don't know why that's getting all wobbly on me. Uh, electronics. We'll make 30 electronics. And then, uh, so we're going to make a methane generator. If you guys don't know what I'm doing here, I, even though I mentioned it before. And boop, boop, boop. And then, so I need a well. Where's the well? Okay, there's the well. And then we need a methane tank, which is right here. But I'm also going to need the extender. So I think I have enough to do the well upgrade as well. Okay, let's go see if we can make some, some methane. If I can refill the the uh, jetpack when it's on my back, then we only need one or two, one or maybe two in case I crash by mistake. My bases are a little far apart. I may have to. I mean, I'm pushing it with fourteen thousand fourteen thousand meters. So let's go ahead and let's let's put another. Let's see. Oh, whoops. That's not what I wanted. Let's unhook that, and put the spectral detector back in. I want to make sure I have water. It's not, it's 88, 89, 90, 90, 100. This is where I want to be. If I got to put another one down, I need to be right where it's at 100%. So let's go ahead and do this. We're going to have to crash out for the night in a second, guys. Let's go blueprints. Let's go, uh, where is it? Well, well, well. Well, well, well. And I guess that'll do. And then the well upgrade. And then we need the blueprints, uh, the methane tank. Oh, we can. Yes, we can. There's the methane tank. And now let's see if we can go ahead and we can uh, just. Uh, oh, I need some ele more electrical cord. Maybe not. I might have. A, I might have enough. I sh uh, where is my transformer? Do I have a spot? I don't. Well, we're gonna make a spot. Let's go ahead and extend our transformer out. Let's see here. Transformer. Where are you? Transformer upgrade. There we go. Just enough room for one. Now let's go ahead and uh, put that away. Let's go ahead and grab this, by the way, so you can see. Open socket five, and we're going to run this to the methane generator. That way I have plenty of power. Is it over here? Is this where it is? There it is. God dang it. There we go. All right, so now let's go ahead and go to the so go over to the transformer. Working this out in my head as I go because I haven't done this before. So, and we've got set number two, which is the methane generator. Let's give it ten. Well, I don't need that much. Fuck, I just screwed everything up. Maybe let's give it. Um, Oh, I don't need that much either. Let's give it, I guess 18 kilowatts is fine. And 1% is all I can give it. Go back to set two, make sure I'm not screwing over this. Oh, you know what? I forgot about number four. That's normally where I plug in my, my rover. I could have plugged this in, that methane generator. That's fine. That's fine. It doesn't matter. Real quick. Let's see if we're producing methane. I want to have some methane by the morning so we can get uh, recharged and go back to the, the base. 
We are producing methane now. So I don't know how much it's going to... It says fill water bottle, fill oxygen bottle. But it doesn't say anything about filling a methane bottle. That's the thing. So I may have to run a methane line... What? Oh, yeah. I may have to run a methane line to the house. And then maybe the CO2 scrubber will, will uh, create a methane bottle. I don't know. I'm not sure uh, how that's going to be how that's going to happen. I don't think I can. I don't have a methane line, so maybe I'll it'll just have to refill it like it's an oxygen bottle, in my in my inventory maybe, and maybe I'll have to go and 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 uh, start. I'll have to go to the methane and the oxygen to fill it up. We'll see. We're gonna go ahead and go to bed. I don't think there's a methane uh, methane pump. Well, you know, there is a methane pump. We could run that to the pump station. Maybe. Oh, yeah, I've got oxygen, so I don't care. Let's take off our helmet. All right. Oxygen source external. All right. We're going to crash out for the night. Sleep, and we'll see how it goes. I'm super happy that we were able to fly all the way back to our base with one jetpack. That's great. That's super helpful. External pressure dropping. It did take me a minute, though. But you know what? It's way faster than the rover. Because, you know, as the bird, as, as a crow flies, as they say, it's from point A to point B in a straight line is the shortest distance. So, all right. So, let's go and go here. Whoops. What am I doing? Losing my mind. Inventory. Put this back on. Didn't use that much water, but. Suit pressurized. Helmet sealed. Let's go ahead and go back into the pressure. into the bathroom. You know what? Since I haven't used the uh, toilet, let's go ahead and let's uh, let's put this compost in our in our. Oh, I didn't bring the seeds. You know what? I didn't know if I was going to be successful. I didn't think I was going to be a. I honestly thought we were going to crash in the middle of uh, the flight. I didn't think I had enough. Uh, I didn't think I had enough energy to, or enough methane to make it. So, I didn't bring anything extra. I was just bare bones. So we're gonna go to the uh, composter and we're gonna take that and recycle. All right. So now we got forty-five point seven zero. All right. Just to recycle all of our stuff. Let's go ahead and let's head back out. Let's see if we can fill up this old this old flyer. 400, 400, 400, 400. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to ditch. You know what? I'm going to ditch a couple of these. So it's the only one in my inventory. If it's the only one in my inventory, then I, then I, I won't get confused. Trust me. Hmm. <laughs> You know what? Let's not put it there. Let's put it in here. There we go. So we're going to move these over, these four. I'm going to go get that other jetpack that's on the ground out there. And we're going to see if we're going to refill it with our oxygen and our methane. All right. Now I landed. Where did I land? Somewhere over here. Okay, there's our jetpack. Picked it up, put it in our inventory, and it's just in our inventory, right? Yeah, it's right there. Let's go ahead and put it down here. And so it's, okay, like I said, 49.09 and 24.54. That's how much we have. Let's go ahead and see if I can refill from this tank. So we have methane stored. I just don't know how we're going to get the methane out of there and into the into the uh, into the jetpack. Oh no, maybe it's over here. It's up here, right? Input well oxygen no device detected for the third one. So there we go. You have to click on this and now it's red for methane. Yeah, that's methane there. All right, so we're going to go ahead and hook this methane up. This is my methane generator, right? Uh, yes, okay. 
So we're going to go ahead and run. I hope I have 100 feet. I'll have to go back inside and make it. Um, there's a methane, and then here, here's the methane to the pump station. And then, why is it, why is it, oh, I see, there it is. There it is. Okay. Now that's the output. Let's go ahead and let's equip this and see if that's how I have to do it. Let's go ahead and put this in my four slot and go four and see about methane replenished that way. There it is. That's how you do it. You got to have it equipped on your body to be able to refill it. I just refilled my, my jet pack. Let's go to oxygen. Uh, I should have some oxygen over here. I guess I would unhook this from here. And then hit four. Oxygen refill. There we go. You see the lights going up? Okay, guys. So that's how you refill your jetpack. You have to have it equipped. You have to have it um, uh, in, in your toolbar equipped. And you have to walk up to whatever, whatever it is that you're, uh, you're using to refill it. Grab that. Let's hook that back up so I don't lose oxygen. Boop. And that's how you, that's how, which, which what you need, guys. So we're going to have to go back and I'm going to have to make a methane generator for the other base. So that I can refill jetpacks. Now that means I only need a couple just in case I hit the ground by mistake. So, and I could have, uh, you know, two, three, four um, jetpacks in my inventory and I can go as far as I need to. Um, we could go on, if I had five jetpacks in my inventory, 50, uh, 50 uh, kilometer jaunt. Well, 25 because you have to return back to the base. Unless you scrap some stuff, you know, obviously. I'm, I'm, get, I'm telling you the obvious because I'm excited. Okay, everybody, so the TLDR is this. Um, you have to equip your jetpack before you walk up to your oxygen uh, replenish station or your methane replenish station, and you do need both. You can get about 6 to 14 kilometers out of a jetpack, depending on how much you use the burn. And um, so putting bases between 6 to 10 kilometers a piece apart seems to be the sweet spot when it comes to flying between bases. I'm going to build a methane generator in the next video, pick up all my seeds. We're going to fly back over there and do some botany so I can unlock the domes so I can go ahead and I can build the domes. So we're going to do a lot of botany in the next video. So that's what we're going to be doing. I'm going to be building, then I'll be building domes. And then once I get the botany done there, I'll come back here. We'll do the same thing over here. And then we'll start looking for a third base location so we can continue our push east so we can get to uh, Olympus Mons, which is the gigantic, um, there's a gigantic mountain that is on this map somewhere and we got to find it. So we're going to, we're, that's the end goal, I think, in this series is to find the mountain and uh, maybe talk to talk to Moses on the mountain. Yeah. Oh, wait. Was it, was it Moses? Yeah, Moses. Yeah, anyway. Ten Commandments. You know what I mean? That's a Bible joke. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for coming in. Hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, give me a thumbs up. And if I've earned your subscription, don't forget to hit that bell icon for notifications. As I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you. And we'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.